Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how to find the cross product of unit vectors using a really powerful trick. So first you write down i hat, then over here you write down j hat, and then over here you write down k hat. And then what you do is you draw arrows like this. So we have an arrow going this way, we have an arrow going this way, and we have an arrow going this way. So now we can compute all cross products uh, with i, j, and k. So if you were to compute, let's say, i cross j. Well, all you would do in this case is just follow the arrow. So we go from i to j, and that takes us to k. So the answer is simply k hat. It's pretty powerful stuff. Let's do j cross k. So j cross k. I'll just follow the arrow, that takes you to i hat. And now last but not least, let's do k cross i. So k cross i hat equals j hat, just follow the arrow. So again, let me use a different color just for emphasis. So if we go from i to j, we get k. If we go from j to k, we get i. And if we go from k to i, we get the next one which is j. If you go backwards, it is exactly the same, except you put a negative sign. So let me use a different color here to hopefully add some clarity. How about purple? So if we go from J to I, so J hat cross I hat, we get K hat, but there's a negative sign. And if you go from I to K, we have I hat cross K hat, we get J hat, but there's a negative sign. And last but not least, if you go from k to j, so k to j, that's going to give us i hat, but there is a negative sign. So if you follow the arrows, you write the answer down. If you go backwards, you put a negative. I hope this video has been helpful.